So, Swoop. Yes. Here we are. Is it time? It's time for your favorite part of the game. The cooker's time. The time to cook it. It's time when I'm cooking out here, the offense side. I got them in the fryer. Like, I'll be hustling. I'll be, I'll be hustling. That's I'll make the sound effect. I'll make a french fries. Yeah? Yeah, because I'm a cooker. Yeah. Yeah. So you got to be able to cook on offense. Yes. So what we're going to do yes. is explain to people a simple way mm -hmm. how to initiate the offense mm -hmm. and just get some structure on the court right. so they can get spacing and play good offense. Offense is all about getting the best shot possible, right? It's all about sharing the ball, uh -huh. moving the ball, screening for each other, mm. making good plays to get your teammate or yourself, right. in your case, the a cooker. good shot. That's right. The cooker got to shoot the ball when the cooker gets the ball. But sometimes the cooker has to screen or pass the ball. That's true. That's, That's rare, true. It's but rare. sometimes it happens. Yeah, because you know I just be cooking. Sometimes you like to cook. I cook. Yeah. All right, so let's go Let's go show them what a uh, good offense is all about. So, here we have it, Swoop. What's up? We got basketball offense. We got the positions on the court like we showed before. Okay. Notice that we have good spacing on the court. That's nice. what it's all about. When you get good spacing, what it creates is open lanes to be able to drive to the basket. Uh huh. It makes it harder for the defense to guard you because you have space to create with the pass or the dribble. So what we have here is a basic one, two, two set, right. or two out, two in, whatever you want to call it. We usually initiate this offense with the pass. King Arthur at the point guard spot is going to pass it to 540. After he passes it, 540 has a couple of options. If he can get a shot off from right there, his first option is to get a shot off. His next option is to dump the ball down into post to Swoop. Now, if Swoop's not open, pass it back out to 540. Swoop's going to go and set a screen. And DP comes across. He posts up at the block. Swoop rolls back to the basketball. Now, go back to your positions. Go back to your positions. When King Arthur initiates with the pass, King Arthur is going to pass the ball. He comes and sets a screen for me. Now, I'm just the release guy. I come back to the middle of the court looking to reverse the ball only if the other options aren't open. So King Arthur is going to initiate with the pass. He's going to come and set a good screen for me. Notice the screen. He's got a wide base. DP waits for the screen. He goes and posts up on what we call ball side. Swoop comes back up to the mid post area here. He can go and pass the ball to Swoop. DP will then turn, open up. Swoop has to pass to DP for a layup. Little high-low. That's a high-low action. Now if you give the ball back to LaMarvin, those guys are in the area right there. After Arthur sets the screen for me, I set my man up. I take him tight off the shoulder, use the screen, and I come back to the basketball right here. Now, when I receive the ball from LaMarvin, DP is on that side right there. Swoop is here. He's going to follow the basketball. Follow the ball, I pass it over to King Arthur. He follows it all the way down to the block. DP can flash high. I come across and I set a screen for LaMarvin. Now, that's a high-low action. We can also, when I get the ball from LaMarvin, go back swoop, he can pass the ball to me. DP can do what's called going block to block. DP can slide across on the backside. Swoop can flatten out. I can pass the ball to King Arthur. DP posts up. He doesn't have anything. We're in the same motion. He goes and sets a screen. Swoop comes ball side, DP flashes high. Same offense, we'll go through it full speed. Come here, set the screen, use it. Uh-huh, yep, come high, swoop, nothing there. Back, reverse, reverse, show it. Here, high, low, finish. Say, yeah! And there you have it, swoop. You look right there, you got good motion, you got good spacing, you got everybody involved, everybody touched the ball, we got good player movement, and then we wind up getting a shot two feet from the basket with our best offensive player inside, DP. Saw the pass? That was a great pass on I, your I, part. I did that. So that's how you do it. <laughs> you got a good motion, get good ball movement, good player spacing, and good uh, shot on the finish. There you have it. Offense with the Wizards.